to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I turn these cheap thrift store pieces into a high-end decor piece. I found these at my local thrift store for 99 cents each and I got this for $1.99 at my thrift store as well. I've already um, sanded this down to give it a good smooth surface and got it ready for the stain. So the other things I will be using, I will be using Waverly chalk paint and ivory. I'll be using Waverly chalk paint and mineral. I'll be using Mod Podge, Rust-Oleum stain. I have painter's tape. I have hot glue gun, paintbrush, some sand, and some cabinet handles. But these came from Walmart. And then I have some greenery and floral back there. So let's get started. want to get out here real quick and let everyone know what has taken so long to get my next video out. When um, The day I started recording this video, I came down with a nasty cold and it turned into bronchitis and so I was sick for a good week and I'm still not completely up to par and my five kids all got sick as well. So that's been the reason for my absence lately. And the next thing I wanted to point out as well, I didn't end up using the painter's tape that I had originally shown in the beginning. Um, I had initially planned to tape off the bottom and to do this down here, but since it already had some texture up top, I decided I'd just go ahead and go with that on the top instead. Um, and I also, instead of using my glue gun, I decided to use E6000 to do the handles because it'll have a much longer lasting hold than the hot glue would.
So here is the final product. I think it turned out absolutely beautiful and it looks like a high-end farmhouse decor piece and everything cost me about oh, it was under ten dollars to make counting everything on here so i think that's a pretty good deal if you were to purchase this in a store it would be a good fifty dollars or more so i think that was a pretty good savings as always thank you guys for watching and please like and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one bye